Yes, I want you to pray because an idol in the family is dealing with people. Untimely death, failure in everything. We rise, we fall. After that, we lost everything. Death comes in. Be prayerful. Okay, man of God. What you are facing, what is going through the family is an idol. Okay, man of God. Look, all of you look to Jesus and you will make a long life. Thank you, are you man French of God. or English? English, man of God. You are English. Yes, man of I'm God. talking like that because you, have, you, it's, you are just alone. No mother, no father, no one to take care to show us the way. Okay, man be of prayerful. God. prayerful. Thank you, man of God. Be prayerful. Okay, Don't be God. an orphan. Okay, man of God. God bless you. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus. So you are welcome to Temple Court's House of Prayer for All Nations in Jesus Christ's name. Can you please tell us your name and where you come from? My name is Andy Priestley. I, am, I was born in the Northwest region, but I'm now living in Douala, spe specifically New Bell. During the service of today, the anointed man of God, Prophet Richard, called you up and gave you a word of prophecy. Can you please share your prophecy with us? Yeah, the prophecy he gave me was a hundred percent prophecy yeah because uh, for the past two years i've been having depression so he said to me this has been a result of idols in the family that has been tormenting us so when he came he said to me i was glad to hear that yes i want you to pray because an idol in the family is dealing with people Untimely death, failure in everything. We rise, we fall. After that, we lost everything. Death comes in. Be prayerful. Okay, man of God. What you are facing, what is going through the family is an idol. Okay, man of God. Look, all of you look to Jesus and you will make a long life. Thank you. Are you man French of God. or English? English, man of God. You are English. Yes, man of I'm God. talking like that because you have you, it's, you are just alone. Is this prophecy true? Yes, this prophecy is true for my life. But there, there's one thing I want to say. Before I came here, uh, what was going through my mind and my spirit was like, if this man is a true man of God, he just spoke a word to me. Because for the past two years, I've been going from other churches so that uh, men of God can pray for me. But when they pray for me, nothing seems changed to me because when you suffer from depression, you cannot read the, you cannot read the Bible well. You, each time you want to pray, there's distraction. Those words do you want to to Jesus Christ so that they can come to pass. They no longer come in their spirit. So when he said this, I was very glad to hear that from him. Amen. And what are, what are some of the challenges you've been facing because of this problem? The challenges I've been facing, there are too many in the family here yeah, because no career, stagnant, marriage challenges, no permanent job. Then at the, at the moment, for the past two years, I could not even walk. There's no energy. I used to be a spotter. I cannot run. All those kind of things. You mean to say you've been faced challenges, untimely death in your family, depression, marital instability, all these things because of the idol worship. You mean to say this, the, these are the challenges you've been going through. Is that right? For sure, that is true. Yes, that's right. And today that God has used the faculties of the anointed man of God, Prophet Richard, to expose the root cause of your problem. Do you believe that this prophecy has liberated your family and given you people a new birth? Yes, it's a new beginning. My past is over. We thank God for your life. We thank God for this wonderful prophecy. And today you came to God because you were challenged. When the man of God, Prophet Richard, touched you, and after receiving, I, I'm just saying, after receiving a touch from the anointed man of God, Prophet Richard, what can you say? How are you feeling now? No, when I receive a touch from the anointed man of God, something just left me. I just feel free. Because even before, I could not jump. If you ask me not to run, I can run. Can you demonstrate what you can? Hallelujah. You can see brother demonstrating what he could not do because of depression. He, he said he has been depressed for the past two years and he could not run, he could not make any keep fit. But today, after receiving a heavenly touch from God through the anointed man of God, Prophet Richard, 
he was released and that is why he is jumping now he's doing what he could not do to the glory of god brother if you could say something concerning the anointed man of god prophet richard what will you say if there was something i was going to say well you know before we used to be proud of cameroon in terms of football but today we should be proud of cameroon in terms of power through our anointed prophet prophet uh, richard amen yesterday you were proud of cameroon in terms of football today you are proud of cameroon because god has sent you people a messenger a true messenger a man of god an anointed one from god and that is the anointed man of god prophet richard for you today we also thank god for what he has done in your life if you were to advise others out there viewers who are depressed who are lonely who are in challenges like you were yesterday what will you advise them i will advise them to come to god is able tv because there there is liberty there is freedom in jesus mighty name amen brother is advising viewers out there who find themselves in challenges that they should run to god because in god you will have a, you will have solution to all your calamities we also advise you that as you go back home to obey God with certainty and assurance so that you've received from God today will remain permanent in your life in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus.